I'm currently at Vesta. It's 12.39 right now and I'm about to meet Caitlin for coffee. She only has a 30 minute break so we're just meeting quick today but I'm excited to see her and just catch up. I think we might even go to dinner tomorrow too but I need to get a picture in the outfit that I'm wearing for White Fox. I have to post on Instagram tomorrow my haul. Today is Monday. It's October 11th and my haul is going live tomorrow but I need to post a picture in this outfit so she's gonna take a picture of me and then we're just gonna have coffee so I'm gonna go in and meet her but yeah I just wanted to update you guys what's going on I'm gonna film a week in my life so I'm just gonna bring you along for little bits here and there this week but I hope you guys are having a good day or a good night whenever you're watching this vlog but yeah we're just gonna go in now this is the dress that I got from White Fox and then I just have on these taller black boots. I got these a while ago from Miss Lola but I felt like they looked really fall so this is the fit today. Caitlin's not here yet but I just ordered for us to go. I got an iced latte with oat milk and then I got her an iced matcha with almond milk unsweetened. And then she loves this egg salad sandwich so I ordered this to go but It'll just be faster so that when she gets here, we can go take the pictures. <laughs> we just made it. This is the restaurant. Just got our food. I got street tacos with cold chicken and avocado. This is Caitlin's, but she's missing her beans. <laughs> and my guacamole. I just woke up so late and I am rushing to get out the door I'm doing a little bra tuck with this sweatshirt and then I'm gonna throw on my new baseball cap we're going super chill vibes because I'm so late I set my alarm and I was so excited to get up early, I said at 4 7, which isn't even that early, and somehow I check the time and it's 8 24 a.m. and I'm like, oh my god, I need to go. I swear I've hit like every single red light on my way here, and I was gonna try to get this off without taking the hat off. This is not going very well. Oh, and now it's green. I'm about to meet Brooke for coffee. And we're just going to Leon Cafe. My camera is about to fall. But we're meeting at 9 and it's 9.07 so I'm late. <laughs> but it's okay. She just texted me that she's almost there so she's late too. Which makes me feel a lot better. <laughs> just got our lattes. I got a latte with oat milk and then Brooke got a latte with almond. Her heart got a little messed up. It doesn't really look like a heart, but it's okay. It's still, it's, it's there. It's, it's just an early morning. It's a thought that counts. <laughs> I didn't know if I should take the baseball one off. I took the tag off, but yeah. Well, that, I mean, if they so were collectible. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was, like, I was like, oh no, I don't care about that. I already drank my whole coffee, and I kind of want another one. It's not bad. We're still gonna sit here for a little bit, so I honestly might just order another. I should have got a bigger size. I only got a small latte. I definitely should have gotten like large. Oh, but it's so cute out here. Got my comfy sweatsuit on. Oh. 
hot coffee to iced coffee. I figured it would just be better to come home and do my work. She ended up going to the store. So I made some oatmeal and I'm just about to edit a video. I only need to do the intro part that I do for my vlogs and then I need to upload it to YouTube and send it to the brand so that it can get approved. But that's what I'm gonna work on right now. And then Brooke was telling me when we were there that the Urban Outfitters in downtown Summerlin finally opened and she said it's so big and it's really pretty. So I think I wanna go to Urban today and just check it out. I've been dying for it to open and I didn't even realize that um, they had an opening day set and that it opened. So I was so excited when she told me that. In the last um, vlog, I literally said you were selling it. Cause remember you were like, did you tell them I was selling the Cadillac? Yeah. I didn't get it. it didn't sell. <laughs> That's for sure. The Cadillac got stolen. So someone took the car, just drove it and dumped it on the side of the road? They said it was in the middle of the street. So the cops said, well, yeah, it was the, they said it was in the street. And Flamingo and Bob, I said it's really in the road. That's that, that's that street right up there. So yeah. Yes. So someone had to have called the cops and been like, there's an empty sure. car in the... For sure. Could you imagine if you saw it? Imagine drive, that's like right next to us. What day was the 9th? Friday, I think. Saturday. What were we doing on Saturday? I bet you it's not even drivable. You think? Yeah, for sure. Huh, why? Because you got the hydraulics. And those break, like if you don't know how to work them, then you just break them. You th really? 100%. Is it this right here? gotten the car back yet there's a situation but we are gonna get coffee right now and then we're gonna go get the car we're going to mothership we haven't been here in a while so I'm just waiting for him while he goes to the bathroom but they have like all of these poles up and like it's all blocked off it looks kind of weird I don't know why they would do that but they might just be like redoing like the grass or like the path or something yeah, it's cute in here besides that part. Yeah, it's so nice with the doors open. We're matching today. <laughs> we really are. They have the good ice. Mom. Mom.com. Mm -hmm. it up right now. Hey. 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 Um, so what's happening? He's taking it home? Taking it home? Taking it home to get stolen again. <laughs> I hope not. It has been such a long day, you guys. Yeah, it's awful. We have been here for so many hours. Yeah. We left at like 1.15 and it's 4.58. 4 yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna grab a picture of this. Why do you have a picture? So bad. So bad. Yeah. That was crazy. That was fix it because the guy wrecked it yeah literally the car is messed up yeah. whoever stole it crashed it into median a median. median and a light pole he says <laughs> that Crazy. is so bad how does that even happen like 
It's been such a crazy day, finally home, and I just feel so bad for Brandon. I think it is so incredibly sad that there are people in this world who will actually steal someone else's car and then on top of it crash it and leave it in the middle of the road. Like, who, like, who would do that? I, I don't know. It just, I can't wrap my brain around it. It's just so sad to me. But... I just made some dinner really quick. I had already made ground turkey on Monday, so I just heated it up and then I heated up some peas and jasmine rice. So I'm about to eat that and probably watch Bachelor in Paradise. I haven't really been watching anything else lately besides Manifest with Brandon. So I'm gonna get more caught up on Paradise because I'm very far behind on it and just eat my dinner, but yeah. What a wild day it's been. I love these EO essential oils hand sanitizing wipes. The French lavender smells so good. I also have the spray, but I'm just quickly wiping down my phone. If you don't wipe your phone down a lot, you definitely should because you don't even think about like the amount of places that you set your phone down. And I'm not even good about like wiping mine enough, but just wanted to give anyone a reminder <laughs> but yeah i love these wipes i use them a lot on my phone or my hands or whatever but i've just been relaxing it's 8 30 now so i'm gonna um probably get ready for bed here soon just so that i can be in pajamas even though i'm already in sweats i just think i should put like pajamas on and wash my face it's 11:21 right now. I wanted to go to bed earlier, but it's just not happening. And I remembered that my mom sent me these gluten-free bites for my birthday. They're in like that little care package that she sent. I don't know why, but I just feel like sitting on the counter right now. <laughs> I don't want to stand. But I got my pajamas on. I washed my face, did my skincare, and I really want to try these. They have five grams of plant protein per serving. They're gluten-free, grain-free, paleo-friendly, and vegan. And they're blueberry and almond bites, but they sound so good right now. Oh my gosh. I could literally eat this whole bag right now. I'm not even kidding. So bomb. kid who like sneaks down to the kitchen in the middle of the night and gets a cookies out of the cabinet and climbs up on the counter <laughs> it says that it um combines gluten-free and grain-free goodness with the flavor of freshly baked blueberry muffins and this 100 percent tastes like the blueberry muffin like for sure that is such a good way to describe it <laughs> Good morning, you guys. I'm just having my coffee and I am like literally out of oat milk and cold brew now. So, gotta go to the store. It's like my weekly trip to get it. But I have some errands to do today and I also have a lot of work I need to get done this morning, especially since I didn't really do a lot of it yesterday. So, I'm honestly just gonna be in front of the computer for a few hours getting all of that done. And then I also wanna go do a workout. But it's nice to just like sit outside, have a few minutes to slowly do my morning. I did my skincare and I got my pjs on but it just like feels so nice out here it's like the perfect temperature because it's not like too hot you're not like sweating but it's like a little chilly warm from the sun i don't know i'm really enjoying it i've been having like my mornings out here every morning lately at least just for like a few minutes and it's been so nice but yeah that's kind of what the plan is for me today baby baby Driving me wild, you driving me so crazy. Got me acting out, got me trying to stay sober. Got me trying to stay sober. Wanted to your love, and I'm out here hungover. You made me want.
wanna take you to London, Paris Make some Times we cherish No comparing to you I just had a really good workout and I'm about to make a post-workout smoothie. I try to make smoothies pretty much every day. I don't know about you guys, but I have such a hard time getting enough veggies in during the day. So it's really helpful for me to make smoothies and put protein powder in them and my um, teamy green superfood blend. I do want to thank teamy for sponsoring this video, but... I am obsessed with the green superfood blend. It has matcha, spirulina, and wheatgrass, and it honestly tastes like an earthy green juice. You don't even need to make a smoothie. You could literally just mix it with water and it's still really good. I personally like doing a smoothie with it, and I just love the taste of the matcha in it, but it has 16 superfood ingredients. It's 100% plant-based, it's dairy-free, soy-free, it's vegan, and it just tastes really good. I don't know why, but like I just can't seem to eat all of the necessary veggies that I should be every day. I will have veggies every night for dinner, but like during the day and lunch and all that, it, it doesn't really go very well for me, so having this is super nice, but I am just going to use this um, premium vegan protein powder with it. I don't have any protein powder left. I literally use like the last scoop in my tub, so I need to order a new one, but I'm going to try out this sample packet. It's a peanut butter flavored, so maybe if I like this, I can order that kind, but I'm just going to do this protein packet with the green superfood blend coconut water and then I'm also just going to add a um, frozen banana into it. So I'm going to make this really quick. The combo of this is so good, you guys. I drink this all the time. And I honestly think that I've seen a difference with drinking this for the last few months. So I definitely recommend it. And I do have a discount code for you guys. It's Bebe Hey, And there's a link in my description box. You can go click it there and order the green superfood blend and check out the rest of their products. But I really think you guys will love it. It tastes so good. The best part about not wearing makeup is you don't get the mask lines because I get that all the time, especially yesterday when I had to keep taking my mask off and on. But you guys, I literally hate wearing masks. Like any chance I get to not wear this, I will take. I just took the best shower. It was like a self-care shower where you wash your hair and your body and you exfoliate <laughs> and shave it just felt so nice i had the water like steaming hot and i finally feel like warmed up and i'm all cozy with my robe on got my slippers on so it's a great night tonight Good morning you guys. I am just getting up for the day. It's like 8 something right now and I'm going to make some coffee. But today is Friday and I'm so happy. It's like almost the weekend. But Brandon and I are going to be going to a little like housewarming party tonight. And I need to film a try on haul for Princess Polly today. It will already be up like way before this video is up. So I need to do that. And then I have some like emails to do this morning. So I just have some work to do. But it's going to be a fun weekend. I bought this oat milk when I was at Smith's yesterday. It's the Chobani Oat Zero Sugar Vanilla. And they didn't have... Well, obviously they don't carry the milk one. I also bought the Oatly just in case I don't like this one. Um, but they didn't have the Planet Oat. 
or the one that I get in stock. So I just figured I would buy this one. I wanted to try a new oat milk. I don't know why, but I just like love trying them all and seeing like the difference. So we're gonna try this out. I need to rinse this. Such a pretty day out. I didn't get a chance to go to Urban on Wednesday because of the whole situation with the car. So I think I might try to go to Urban today. I have a nail appointment at 1.30. So maybe after my nails I'll go, but I'm so excited. I'm gonna do something different. I don't know exactly what, but I can't wait to get this like cracked nail fixed because it's really been bothering me. actually got like pretty frothy Oops. it kind of has an interesting vanilla taste I just parked in downtown oh dang it I brought the wrong Lipstick, it's my like old pillow talk one that like has nothing left of it So I guess I'm just gonna do some gloss But it's okay. I'm in downtown Summerlin and I'm gonna go check out the new urban I think I'm gonna get a coffee too it's so nice because there's anthropology right here. There's free people There's urban like downtown Summerlin is finally getting all the good stores i didn't show you guys my outfit before i left and i just put on this sweater vest top from princess polly my a goldie jeans and then my um shadow sneakers i just wanted to wear something like casual but still cute and this sweater top is in my recent princess polly haul if you guys missed it but you guys can use my code it's baby hey for 20 percent off so if you want to get the sweater vest and get a little deal on it you can i'm just gonna get coffee thank you this is the new urban looks so nice I'm pretty sure this is the jacket that Julia Havens posted in today and it's so soft. The new Urban is literally so cute. I don't have a lot of time because I need to um, go because I'm meeting up with Brandon, but they have so many good fall pieces. I'm definitely gonna come back. I just wanted to make that return. I could only get a gift card, but I was like, okay, no worries. It was a pair of pants that I got over the summer. They were honestly just like a little bit too big for me so i'm gonna go back one day and like look at their i love their bdg line all their pants are super good so i just need to find a pair in my size so i'm gonna go back one day when i have like more time to like shop around and try things on my nails turned out so good you guys i just went for chocolate brown tips and I'm honestly obsessed with them. I wanted something that was like fall, but I also wanted something still neutral, and they are perfect. Look at that cutie over there. Got an iced chai tea with light almond milk, no foam, hold the classic light flaxseed oil. <laughs> what? Yeah. No. <laughs> no, I got nice latte with oat milk today. Did you already put your stevia in there? Yeah? Mix it all up. That's good. Vodka. <laughs> Like you're walking forever like you're doing it over and over again yeah yeah i don't like that one no.
exciting. No. <laughs> I'm gonna miss the car. Possibly. We'll see. So much. It's currently 11:48. We were at Starbucks for like an hour and a half. Oh really? Yeah. Holy shit. Cause we left at 10. God, you're such a chatty cat. <laughs> No. <laughs> you don't even know that person. Who? <laughs> <laughs> uh. You don't even know who it is. Yeah, do. What are you tagging? Not the guy in the Cadillac. <laughs> <laughs> gotta go buy more shirts from Chance. You do? Yep. You need more? Yeah. Don't you have eight now? Yeah, but I noticed after a while they kind of fucking fall apart. It's <laughs> because they're um like they four shirts for twenty dollars. They don't fall apart. They just don't. They a they don't dry as good, and then b they shrink. What colors do you want? White and black. I can get them. For no, you. no, no. What? I can get them. <laughs> you said that last time. A month had gone by, you hadn't gotten the shirt. Shh. So I was like, I'll just go for you. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, babe. You're welcome. We just walked by the Golden Knights practice facility. It's so sunny. Wasn't this a Forever 21? Was it? Do they not have one here now? Not in this place. It just at the strip? Get fashion show. Yeah. Fun anything when you come? Um, I returned something. I didn't like really look. Gotcha. I didn't have a lot of time because we were leaving. Where were we going? The housewarming party. I came like right before. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Yeah. Do you like any of these? Not Miller. Oh. Oh my god. This is a baby ass. <laughs> Who wears this? Oh my god. He looks so funny with that. Can you try this? <laughs> Cute. Look like how cool it is this. <laughs> <laughs> We're at Macy's now, and they have Brandon's favorite shirts. So he's really happy. <laughs> so happy. Oh, they have them all. They do? In your size? And in gray. Get the French out of here. Oh my gosh. It's your lucky day. That looks good. That looks super good. Yeah, that's actually nice. I'm in the gym. I need to put the camera down because honestly my arms are shaking. I'm doing shoulders, chest, and tries today, but this past week with my workouts has been so hard for some reason. I've just been having a really difficult time coming down to the gym. I've come most days. There have been a couple days that I didn't even work out, but I think it's just because I like doing my workouts earlier in the morning. And if I don't do my workout like before noon, then I just have such a difficult time like actually going down to the gym. I just feel like not the day is over. It's not what I think, but I just feel like I want to be ready and I want to get other stuff done. But in the mornings this past week, I've just had so much work to do. So it's just been a little bit harder for me, but we're here, we're doing it. It's currently, couldn't tell which way my phone was, 3.25, so I'm gonna finish up the workout. I've just been doing a lot of like upper body stuff today and it's been good. My arms are like literally shaking and yeah, I'm feeling it. So I'm gonna finish it, 
finish this up i also i got my new nike baseball cap on you guys have obviously already seen it today but it's the one from urban and the blue la one and i've been loving wearing baseball caps so much lately honestly just because i've been like lazy to do my hair i haven't really wanted to wash it just because i feel like it gets greasy so fast when i keep washing it so i've been wearing caps more and oh i just lost an AirPod. Oh my god, I just, I literally just lost both my AirPods, you guys. <laughs> Currently at Discount Tire getting my tires checked because the back right one is way too low. So I'm just getting this fixed really quick. I got the chicken gyro wrap. I'm so excited to eat this. It has romaine, cucumber, red onion, cherry tomatoes, chicken, chickpea, microgreens, and avocado, and then their dressing, but I love their wraps. My wrap was so bomb, you guys. I feel like there's something in my teeth, though. It's the one thing about going and getting food is that I need to like brush my teeth and floss my teeth after. So I'm gonna go home and do that. I wish I had like floss in my car. I if I do. Sometimes I do. Oh my gosh, I think I do. I'm gonna be so happy if there's floss in here. Oh, this is so great. Not that like it really matters because I'm not seeing anyone right now. I'm just gonna go home, but it's like really bothering me. Oh, so much better. Okay, now I can brush my teeth and I go home. But it was just like stuck in my tooth. Also, I don't know if you guys do this. It's probably kind of gross. But like, do you guys use your door pocket as like a garbage can? Because like, I do that and then I'll like clean it out. Probably shouldn't. Hope Brandon isn't watching this. He hates when there's any garbage or trash in the car. And like, I totally feel that. But sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. So, I'll clean that later. But... Yeah, my wrap was bomb. I usually get the plant powered Caesar, but I got the chicken gyro one and it was literally so good. All the wraps are so good and I'm honestly really full, but I was super hungry before I got here. So it worked out great. And then I got a little bit of editing done, but I still have so much to do when I go home. Like I'll probably do that for the next couple hours. So I think I'm just going to close out this vlog here, but I do hope you guys enjoyed it and make sure that you are subscribed to my channel and you have my post notifications on and then also give the bit, the bid, I was going to say give the video, but I said give the bid, give the video a big thumbs up if you liked it, it would mean a lot to me <laughs> and I will see you guys next time, bye guys.